Hey everybody, it's Dean Etheridge and today I'm making a video that will show you how to eliminate some backgrounds in your images even if they're tough to remove. Uh, a lot of times we face that and unless you know how to use Photoshop really well or I've used Microsoft Paint but it's a, a long tedious process. ClippingMagic.com is a, a pretty inexpensive software that I use to do some of the harder images where I need to remove some backgrounds but let me just give you an idea of what you can do out at clippymagic.com. Uh, basically what I'm going to do is go out and choose a file and this is a file that I want to get a white background and the reason being is because I was using a separate logo today on a white background and while this one is fine if I put that on a black background it's going to blend in and, and just not look very good so uh, Doug's away today and, and not near his computer so I was just going to remove the white background uh, from this this black image that I have but let me show you exactly what we do to remove backgrounds from even tough to find images. You can see down here at the bottom the brush size is 20 pixels. I'm just going to change that to 10 just so I can draw a little bit easier but basically I'm going to highlight in green at the top what I want to keep and it's easier with a, a bigger picture but this is this is one of the tougher ones that you'll do okay you can blow this up actually make that a little bit easier to draw in okay and I just want to highlight this okay and basically that's what I want to keep is the, the circle, the white letters, but I want to get rid of everything else. So I'll click the red button and I'll just start going around. And you'll see that I've gotten rid of most of this. Okay, it's starting to look good already. But if I want to do some fine tuning I'll change this pixel size here, go back to red, one little section there, let's blow that up a little bit more, okay, now basically my background's gone and I just wanted to make a, another logo, take this, put small business marketing in it because our, our slogan is 360. We're doing virtual tours and that kind of thing for our business. But just to give you an idea, um, I'll download this. Okay, and there's my image now. It looks, it's, it's uh, white, no background. I can copy that. And you can see I've already finished the logo, but just to show you kind of what I did with it. I can take that, format it, put a little background behind it with Microsoft Publisher. I put my text in there and now when I go out to my black header I now have this cool logo in the back instead of a uh, black logo which would have blended in uh, wrong letters just just wouldn't have worked that well so if you want to do a picture I, I'll show you that really quick it's simple to do a picture. Okay, this is what we see a lot of times and if I just want to do me in a picture, I'll highlight that and put red, go around that real quick. You can see it's starting to disappear already. And change this brush size get that little black spot out there and that's it so I can download that picture and my background is now gone I can do that for uh, flowers trees whatever I want to remove from the background and do some pretty cool stuff like this so so check them out at clippymagic.com and you can visit me at deanethers.com if you have any comments leave those just down below in the comments section uh, you can give me a thumbs up if you like this video I just think it's a great tool to use if you're removing backgrounds pretty consistently it's worth checking into so make it a great day and i look forward to seeing you on the next video